Hey, this is Mr. Adams again with uh, our last installment, our last segment of the virtual tropical middle school tour. I hope this has been helpful for you guys. What we're talking about today is the end of the day, it's the end of the tour. So we're talking about the end of the day. As you can see, we're in the sixth grade quad where many of you will be at the end of the day. Although some of you may be in, in the band room or the, the gym with PE or in a couple other rooms, this is where most of you will be. So there's options here. It all depends on what you're doing after school. So if you are a parent pickup, we have two places where you exit the campus for parent pickup in the parking lot. Right here you see room 11 and the room 11 gate. That's where you will exit and then find your ride. Okay, if you're further down, let's head this way. We're gonna show you the room 14 gate. So, a normal thing for students to do when that bell rings is to just sprint out and get to the spot where they wanna be. Don't do that, please. It causes a lot of problems if everybody's running around. Okay, let's stop right here real quick. I wanna show you this field, the, the quad part, this area, this grassy area. This is where our after school program meets. Okay, so if you are in the after school program with Mrs. Catrufo, you are gonna meet here in this area. Okay, and she will gather you guys and then take you to snack back in the cafeteria. That's after school program only. So let's head this way. So again, when you're coming out, be very respectful. No running, try not to do any crazy behavior. We wanna make sure that uh, we're very safe. Got it? All right. So we talked about the room 11 gate where you go for parent pickup. This is the room 14 gate. There's room 14 and this is the room 14 gate. So if your parent is picking you up and you're on this side of the campus, you can come right out here. Okay, it's gotta be through one of these two gates for parent pickup, or if you walk home, you can come out either of these gates. But these are the only two gates that will be open. So make sure you go out of one of those two gates. Now, if you're going to be picked up by the bus, <coughs> excuse me, or if you have uh, sports after school and it's in the gym, this is the route you're gonna take. So on our earlier tours, we've been down this route before, where you have the library here, IT over there, it's the same route. Okay. You follow this route, again, you've got a lot of kids coming this way and they're all coming into the same area, so be very respectful of each other. No pushing, no shoving, okay? You'll see a lot of people gathering out here, a lot of kids gathering, because this is where you gather for your bus pickup. Now, there is no specific place that you have to be. Basically, you have this whole area to hang out until your bus comes. You don't have to be in one area. And again, when the buses come, our guards will hand up, hold up signs with the number of the route and they'll call for your route. They'll be over by those double gates and they'll ask you to line up. So if they call route one, route one will go over, line up at the gate. When everybody is in line, you'll have your backpacks in front of you with your bus pass ready and you will board the buses. Once everybody is boarded and seated, the bus will leave and you're on your way home, okay? And if you are doing basketball or volleyball after school, you'll go to the gym. We've already shown you the locker rooms and area. You'll be able to change in there, get ready for your sport. There's so much more to tell you, but this is the virtual tour part of, of getting you the information about Tropico. Uh, I'm really excited. I hope we have a regular school year so I can enjoy all of you every day. Uh, I'm excited to have you incoming sixth graders at Tropico. I wish you the very best of luck. I hope you all stay safe. I wanna thank Mr. Garcia, who's holding that camera right now. He's our lead campus safety officer and does a great job. Thank you, Mr. Garcia. And we'll see you all hopefully, prayerfully in a couple of months.